Haleluya. Tuko katika wiki ya maombi na tunaendelea katika maombi na najua ya kwamba uko hapa ni kwa sababu kuna jambo unataka Mungu atende katika maisha ni mwako. But I want to promise you that Jesus never fails. He never fails in our lives. Yeye hawezi akakosa Bwana apewe sifa. Wakati unapoenda kumtafuta Wakati unapo acha shughuli zako, umeacha biashara zako, umeacha watoto wako wengine ni wachanga na umekuja ili ukaweze kumtafuta huyo Mungu. Lazima utapatana na huyo Mungu. Maana yeye habadiliki. Ni yule jana leo na hata milele aliwatembelea wengi. Wengine walikuwa na magonjwa wakapata kupona. Aliwatembelea waliokuwa na mashida kila aina. Wengine walimta futa kwa sababu watoto wao walikuwa wamekufa. Biblia inasema wakati Yesu aliingia katika zile miji zao maisha yao ilibadilika. Hali zote zilibadilika. Sande niliwambia ya kwamba wakati Yesu aliingia katika nyumba ya kina Martha na Lazaro, mambo haikubaki vile ilivyokuwa. Biblia inasema ya kwamba alipoingia pale, alipokutana na waliokuwa wanaomboleza, alisema tu nionyeshe mahali mulipomweka na wakati alipoonyeshwa ile kaburi mahali alikuwa Yesu akamuita kwa sauti haleluya nataka kukwambia kuna mambo lazima uyaite kwa sauti kuna mambo ambayo katika maisha ni mwako yaliyokufa ndui alifikiria ya kwamba amekuweka chini you have to speak the voice of god na wakati utakapoyaita yatakuja katika jina la Yesu ana our Jesus is alive haleluya Yesu yuko hai na akiwa hai na ako ndani yetu whatever we speak in faith he will fulfill it because he is God haleluya today in the name of Jesus Christ we are going to pray and we are going to call upon Jesus and Jesus will answer our prayer haleluya na chua Mungu wangu anajibu E, ninaibaga hiyo wimbo anajibu maombi anajibu maombi haleluya sijui kama Yesu wako anajibu maombi lakini yule ninayemwamini yule akaenda ndani yangu anajibu maombi haleluya anajibu maombi haleluya kwa hivyo siku hii ya leo atajibu maombi yako praise the lord atakujibu maombi Haleluya. Na atakuweka huru. Haleluya. Ninataka kuanza na kuongea about the freedom. Freedom, liberty hiyo. Haleluya. Nitakuwa nikiongea about freedom. Maana when Jesus came into this earth. Yesu hakuwa na misha nyingine. Wakati alikuja Yesu kusudi la Yesu ilikuwa tu moja kuweka watu huru Praise the Lord Mission ya Yesu Mission ile tunaenda kuhubiria watu nje ni freedom about Jesus When you have Jesus you are free from every evil You are free, you are free, you are free. Praise the Lord. When you have Jesus Christ, you are free from every curse, from every demon attack, from every forces of darkness. Freedom. Yesu alikuja kuleta uhuru. Let me read for you the word then we shall play in Jesus name Naweza soma katika kitabu cha Mariko na nitaruka eh, katika kitabu cha 1st John chapter number 3 Let me read Kiingereza kwa sababu ya kwenda haraka Praise God Inasema hivi from verse number 1 Now when they drew near Jerusalem 
to Bethphage and Bethany at the mountain Oris. He sent two of uh, he sent two of his disciples, and he said to them, "Go into the village opposite you, and as soon as you enter, it will find." A court tile on which one on which one on which no one has sat, lose it and bring it and bring it. And if any, anyone say to you, Why are you doing this? Say, The Lord has need of it, and immediately. He will say it here. So they went their way and found the court tied by the door outside on the street. And they loosened it. But some of those who stood there said to them, What are you doing, losing the court? Are they spoke to to them just as Jesus has commanded. So they let them go. First John chapter three first number first number eight Nasoma he he who sin is of the devil. For the devil has seen from the beginning, for this purpose, the Son of God was manifested that he might destroy the work of the devil. Baba nasema ni asanti, neno lako nita katika migu yetu. Bwana wacha neno lako likaangazi. Acha neno lako likatende kusudi lako. Katika jina la Yesu. Na uba na kushukuru. Amen. Nimesema hii ni wiki ya maombi. Na nimeko letea neno la mungu. Na uba muketi wale wa mesi mama kwa daka chache. Yesu aliwatuma wanafunzi wake. Akawambia endeni katika mji ule ulio karibu nanyi na mkiingia katika ule mji mtapata mwana punda aliyefungwa kando ya hiyo barabara mfungueni mumlete kwangu na yule mwana punda biblia inasema ya kwamba hakuna mtu yeyote aliyekuwa amekalia yule mwana punda Yule mwana punda alikuwa amekaa pale alifumilia jua kali alifumilia mateso alifumilia hali ambaye watu walipita katika ile barabara sijui kama walimpa chakula sijui kama kuna mtu alimwonea huruma Yesu mwana wa Mungu akatumana nilikuwa najiuliza katika mawazo yangu Yesu alijuaje ya kwamba katika hiyo njia aliyewatuma wana, uh, wanafunzi wake ya kwamba kuna mwana ameketi mahali pale Na walipotoka maana Biblia inasema walipotoka kama vile Yesu alivyowaambia waliondoka na wakaenda na walipokuwa wakienda walipofika katikati ya ile njia walipofika mahali Yesu alipowaambia wakampata yule mwana punda na wakati walipompata wakamfungua kama vile Yesu aliposema na wakati walimfungua wakamleta kwa Yesu na wakati alikuja kwa Yesu yule mwana punda 
Hajawai kuwa celebrate. Hajawai furahiwa na watu. Hajawai tandikiwa matandi. And Biblia inasema ya kwamba Yesu alipokalia yule mwanapunda. Maisha yake ikabadilika. Hali yake ikabadilika alikuwa akichomwa na jua alikuwa akiteseka alikuwa kule hata hakuna mtu alikuwa anamsugulikia lakini Yesu alipombeba Yesu hali yake ikabadilika Biblia inasema ya kwamba walitoa wanawake maleso wakamtandikia wakaenda wakisifu wakimwimbia Yesu mwanapunda bado ndiye alimbeba Yesu Hallelujah. You need to be celebrated. You need to be honored by men. Mbebe Yesu. Praise the Lord. Mbebe Yesu katika moyo wako. Mbebe Yesu. Usiogope. Usiangalie watu watasema nini. When you testify about Jesus, usiangalie watu watakuangalia namna gani. Yule umebeba ni mkuu. Yule ako ndani yako ni mkuu. Yule ako ndani yako ni saidi ya vile wanakuona. Ni saidi ya vile wanakufikiria. Praise the Lord. Mwanapunda alifunguliwa. Na mwanapunda alitembea akiwa akifurahia akiwa akiimbiwa nyimbo Yesu alipoimbiwa hosana naye mwanapunda yuko hapa amembeba mwana kondoo naye anaibiwa pamoja wanasema hosana the purpose of Christ he came to change our life he came to make way where seems to be no way Jesus came to make everything turn around in your life. Bwana pewe sifa. Things will turn around in your life. Why? Because you have Christ in you. You are carrying the kings of kings. Mkubwa wa rais anaitwa rais Uhuru. Rais ambaye anaitwa rais Ruto. Wewe ndiye umembeba. And I was looking at the scripture And I was looking and I was asking myself Wakati wakina Samuel Wakati wa mfalme Daudi Hakuna mfalme ambaye hakumu hakumpa Mungu nafasi ile ya kwanza Ninataka kukupeleka sasa katika maombi It is the church to stand in the gap when we stand in the gap even every shake up in our nation will stop still why because we have the king of king in us praise the lord as we pray as we pray for our nation as we pray for our family let us know that sisi si watu vile watu wanatuonanga haleluya unaweza jiguza tu hivi useme bila watu wananiona sio vile niko praise the lord unajitabilia unajihubilia because i have the son the son of jesus the son of god is in me now if the son is in me Nothing can shake me. Why? Because I'm full of power. Praise the Lord. Freedom to me pata. We are free. We are free. Why? Because Jesus has been manifested in our lives. Yesu alipokuja alikuja tu kutufungua alitufungua kutoka utumwa wa dhambi akatufungua kutokana na itikadi miuko zilizokuwa zikiabudiwa kwetu sanamu walikuwa wanafanya sisi tumekopolewa sasa sisi si wale wa pale ya fulani 
praise the Lord. We are free. And if you are not free, today, in the name of Jesus, you will confess your sin. And you shall be free. And the Bible says, whosoever the Son set free, he is free indeed. Praise God. So as we pray, we are free. We are going to free our children. We are going to free our families. We are going to free even this nation. Anything that is shaking in our nation, it will stand still. Why? Because we have God in us. We have Christ and Christ will rule everything in Jesus' name. Mother, the master is in need. Praise God. Wakati mfalme, tuseme mtu anaitwa rais, rais wa Kenya. Aseme right now, ninataka kwenda redeem gospel church, kwenda kutembea huko. He is the head of state. He will just come. Why? Because he has the authority. We have the authority of Christ. Because God has given us the son. The son of Jesus. The son Jesus Christ is in us. So we are free. Praise the Lord. If you are free, can you stand up? If you are free, can you stand up? Today, I just want to give you things that we are going to pray for. Those few minutes we have, we are going to pray for our children. We need our children to be like, yani nataka, ata sisemi nataka awe kama nani. But you, you are the parent. Unataka mtoto wako akue na mnagani. Whatever you speak, it will be so. In the name of Jesus. It is you. Utatamuka. Maneno mazuri. Katika maisha ya mtoto wako. Hata kama nilisema last time. Hata kama mtoto wako analewanga, anaanguka uko kwa barabara. It is you. You will save his soul. Utamuokoa na maobi yako. Utamuleta karibu nawe katika china la Yesu Kristo. Maana china la Yesu liko na ngufu. Wana pewe sifu. Second thing. Tutaomea watoto wetu. We will separate our children with the things that are operating. Mambo ambao yanaendelea katika wakati huu wa mtadao watoto wetu watakuwa watoto wa mcha bwana watoto wetu they will have the fear of god the bible says in the book of proverbs uh, that the fear of the lord is the beginning of understanding hallelujah if you want your child to be somebody who can understand even the things that are operating it takes you to pray for him or her. Pray. Pray without ceasing. Unakubatia huyo mtoto unatamuka maneno masuri katika china la yesu. Another thing. We are going to pray for our nation. We are praying for the politician. We are changing the story. Hatuta daganywa. We are putting the things straight through prayer in the name of Jesus. Wewe kama mtu ni wakudaganya, unamuodoa katika raini. Hata pita mahali unapitia. Mahana we are tired. Hatutaki watu waongo. Tunataka watu wale watasema ukweli katika moyo wao. Katika jina la yesu. And this nation will move forward. Hallelujah. Mana mungu anaangalianga ukweli wake. Tamuka ukweli. Uone kama mungu. Hata fanya jambo katika iyo hali. Katika jina la yesu. Another thing. To Taomba, we will cover our nation with the blood of Jesus. Maroho na pepo sakuhua watu. 
wasichana wadogo watu kukufa barabarani tunakataa hiyo sohari katika jina la Yesu every black spot we will speak the blood of Jesus in that black spot we will change the black spot by the blood of Jesus because we have the sun in us hallelujah any black spot will hear the voice of God and it will change by the power of God in the name of Jesus hallelujah tukimalizia kuna mambo mengi lakini ninaguza moja moja ndio tukiingia hatuta hatutaendelea tumalizie hallelujah kila kingine we need to pray for the things that are bothering us kuna mambo saigine unakuta inakusumbua ninataka hiyo itakuwa tu uh, hali ya mwisho abia bwana anything that is bothering your life whether it's finances whether it's debts ni nini hiyo kinakusumbua ni nini ukikaa in the presence of god you feel like hauko sawa i just want you to speak it before god muambie bwana hii ndio hali inanisonga hii ndio hali ninapoinua mikono yangu ninakuta ya kwamba ninashindwa you will receive healing in the name of jesus god will change it god will deliver you god will give you something else in your spirit you will think about god you will think about christ you will think about the things of the kingdom praise the lord unajua biblia inasema seek the kingdom of god first and the rest shall be added so wakati hata tunatafuta we normally know tunaenda kasi brother steve but we know in those business without Christ in that business nothing can happen it is only Jesus to be the center of whatever we are doing this is the time to tell God to remember us as we pray in the mighty name of Jesus haya mengine tutamalizia bado tuko na kesha inakuja We shall pray hallelujah kwa sababu tumeitwa kuomba hatujaitwa unajua kuhubiri ni sawa lakini ile kitu inaweza saidia mkristo ni wakati mtu anaomba the doors that always we pray to be open inafunguliwa na maombi wakati unaomba Mungu sio tu hapa tu tuko na wiki ya maombi you pray every day every day in your life every hour ukiwa unatembea kwa barabara you just pray unaambia bwana ninajua hata kule ninaenda sijui bwana yale umetengeneza kwa ajili yangu and when you go god will be there for you in the name of jesus Pungua kinywa chako. Mwambie tu Bwana ya kwamba siku hii ya leo ninataka tu Bwana akaweze kukusaidia. Nikiimba hii wimbo wewe ingia tu kwa maombi alafu Mungu atakutia nguvu katika jina la Yesu. Whatever you ask in his name he will answer your prayer because he is God. Yeye ni Mungu mwaminifu. Yeye ni Mungu asiyeshindwa. Yeye ni Mungu mwenye uwezo wote. Anaweza, anaweza yote. Anaweza katika maisha yako, anaweza kutenda mambo makuu. Anatenda yale ambaye haujafikia kuyaelewa. Maana yeye ni Mungu katika jina la Yesu. Endelea kumuita Yesu. Endelea kumuita Yesu. Naimba wimbo kwa wengine lugha hii hautaisikia. But ninaimba na najua Roho Mtakatifu atakusaidia katika jina la Yesu. 
Karibu na wewe Mungu wangu Karibu na wewe ndio Bwana tutaenda Karibu na wewe Simba wa Yuda hapo ndipo tutakaa Maana kwako Yesu kuna msamaha kwako Yesu kuna ushindi Baba jioni ya leo tunanyenyekea mbele zako tukikuita Yesu Maana wewe ndiye baba wetu wewe ndiye msaada wetu Bwana tunanyenyekea mbele sako mfanme wa rehema kwa ajili ya watoto wetu bwana tunawainua mbele zako adonai mungu wetu baba wetu mungu usiyeshindwa ulijua wakati kama huu bwana utatupatia watoto ulijua wakati kama huu baba generation of god tutakuwa ili tukaweze kusimama kwa ajili ya watoto wetu father we pray that you may remember our children we commit them to you in the mighty name of Jesus baba ukawa tawale bwana ukawa elekeze katika jina la Yesu tunawatenka na watu ambao bwana wanaweza kuwa elekeza katika njia isiyo ya haki katika jina la Yesu we separate them oh God, with the kingdom of darkness we declare our children oh God, will be a nazarite in the heart house of God in the mighty name of Jesus we declare our children are chosen kabla dunia ijaumbwa bwana uliwachagua ukasema katika kitabu cha Jeremiah ya kwamba bwana ulitochagua hata kabla hatujaubika uliwachagua hawa watoto hata kabla hawajaubika ukawafanya kuwa kile bwana unataka wawe siku ya leo mtakatifu dunia na mambo ambayo yanaendelea hayatawatoa katika njia zako haitawatoa katika magi so yako katika jina la Yesu we pray for our young wote walio inche tunawakrema katika jina la Yesu we speak salvation omesema nasi bwana ya kwamba umetutuma tuende tukamfungue mwana punda aliye inche siku ya leo baba yangu waliofungwa tunawatangazia kufunguliwa katika jina la Yesu waliofungwa na miraa tunawatangazia kufungolewa katika jina la Yesu hawa ndio viongozi wa kesho hawa ndio bwana makuhani wa kesho tunawatangazia minyororo ikakatike katika mashani mwao katika jina la Yesu waliofungwa na madawa za kulevia hawa ndio waijilisti wa kesho tunawafungua katika jina la Yesu tunatangaza maisha yao mawazo yao ikaf 
ufungolewe katika jina la Yesu ufalme wa giza hauna uwezo na uzaliwa wa sasa katika jina la Yesu baba wale walio inche wengine wamefungwa na roho ya ulevi tunawafungua katika jina la Yesu Baba wetu na Mungu wetu ulitupa watoto wakawe wa baraka katika familia umetupa watoto wakawe viongozi katika familia we pray to Jehovah God that you may have mercy upon our children to nawaondoa katika itikadi maroho machafu ambao yanaopareta through the media oh Jehovah we say no our children will serve the mighty God in the name of Jesus Christ father today we speak life in those those who are dying in the mighty name of Jesus there is life in our tongue to not declare life in our children life in our village our children in our village shall live to declare the goodness of the Lord in the mighty name of Jesus we speak salvation those who are not born again we claim them Lord God to the kingdom of God in the name of Jesus Father God every portage that they have been in we command it to pass before the old God in the name of Jesus our children oh God will serve you in the name of Jesus we speak of freedom to their mind to their soul in the name of Jesus Christ nakupa sifa yesu nakupa utukufu we pray for our nation we commit this nation to your able hands oh god umetupa inchi hii maana ni inchi yetu ambaye bwana umetupatia tunakupatia inchi hii bwana tunakataa uofu ambao unatendeka katika jina la yesu tunatangaza damu ya yesu katika jina la yesu inchi yetu bwana itanawere bwana kutakuwa kama sawa mazuri hakutakuwa na kuraramika we command the spirit of mamali oh in the name of jesus leave us leave us in the name of jesus we will call upon jesus we will call upon you you are the answer of our nation in the name of jesus the bible says that the name of the lord is a strong tower the righteous lana unto it and they are safe we have no other name it is you Jesus you will bring freedom in our nation oh God in the name of Jesus Christ we pray for the finances in our nation by God my father you will come through because you are God you are our father we trust in you in the name of Jesus Christ father lord we pray even for our Lord we speak the blood of Jesus maroho ambao inaleta watu kuuliwa katika barabara tunakataa maafa za ajali tunakukataa hauna nafasi katika nchi hii the bible says whatever we speak it shall come to pass leo siku ya leo tunasimama kinyume na maroho za ajali tunakataa katika jina la Yesu watu wetu watakuwa salama wote wanao safi wakienda Mombasa wakienda Kisumu wakienda in the county we speak the blood of Jesus baba wa rehema hata even the black spot we speak the blood of Jesus in those black spots we change it in the name of Jesus to nasmia the blood of the lamp in those area in the name of Jesus oh king of all glory be exalted in every area in the mighty name of Jesus tunaomba Bwana utukufu wako ukaonekane katika jina la Yesu onekana Adonai Bana wewe ni Mungu baba wa uweso tunaponeka enche hena damu tunanena ulinsi Bwana linda watu wako walinde mchana na usiku wewe ulinda Israeli usio lala usio sinsia linda watu wako Bwana katika jina la Yesu baba wetu na Mungu wetu in this hour, oh God, we commit anything, Jehovah God, that is lifting itself against the knowledge of God. We cast it down in the name of Jesus. Chochote ambacho kinajinua katika maishani mwako. 
hicho kinakufanya moyo wako ufinyiliwe na kiamuru katika jina la Yesu ikakuachilie ikakuachilie inaweza kuwa ni deni Bwana akakuwezeshe ukaondoke katika ile deni katika jina la Yesu our God is able our God is mighty our God is able he is able to change every situation in the name of Jesus Baba wetu na Mungu wetu jioni hii leo ukainoliwe ukainoliwe kwa familia ukainoliwe kwa wazazi in the mighty name of Jesus we declare the power of God in our family we declare the presence of God wherever we shall go the presence of God will change the life of many in the name of Jesus Christ Bible says that wherever you went to God you change the life of people wewe ni Mungu wa ajabu Bwana wa macheshi ukiwa ndani yetu nasi tunaenda tukienda kuahubiria waliofungwa wacha wakabadilike katika jina la Yesu we pray for our crusade we commit it to you Father God this year we pray that you shall be with us wherever we shall minister wherever we shall go to bring this gospel father you will be glorified in the mighty name of jesus you shall draw men to yourself in the mighty name of jesus unasema bwana tukikuinua juu utawaleta wengi kwako bwana mji huu wa roiro tunakuinua juu tunakuinua kama redeem gospel church tunakuinua mahali hapa bwana anza kubadilisha wale wanaokaa katika maeneo haya wanaokaa katika manyumba zinazo tusunguka we speak salvation to them oh God in the mighty name of Jesus tunaomba bwana ukawafungue ukawaleta nyumbani mwako maana katika nyumba yako hapo ndipo kuna amani hapo ndipo kuna ushindi katika jina la Yesu bwana wa rehema pokea sifa zote pokea utukufu maana wewe ni Mungu hakuna wa kufanana na wewe usiku wa leo bwana unasema ni asante umekuwa nasi katika wiki ya maombi bwana tumekuona tumeona uwezo wako tumeona ukuu wako tumeona bwana ukitenda mambo mema tuko na sababu ya kusema mbele zako asante asante kwa kutupa neema neema ya kuomba it is by your grace that we are able to pray it is not us it is your holy spirit that pray within us i pray in the name of Jesus that Lord Almighty you will continue to fill us once again you will continue to do wonders in us in the mighty name of Jesus baba wetu na mungu wetu ukapokea utuko ukapokea heshima maana wewe ni mwema wewe ni mwaminifu watawala milele hakuna wakufanana na wewe jioni ya leo bwana asante kwa kutupa hii nafasi hakuna aliyekuita bwana akabaki vile alivyokuwa oh bwana wale hema wote walioingia usiku wa leo kukutafuta kutana na haja za mioyo yao katika jina la Yesu send somebody free in the name of Jesus i declare freedom in their lives oh god in the name of Jesus King of all glory be exalted be lifted on high because you are our God you are our father hakuna kama wewe wewe ni mwaminifu bwana Asante kwa kutujali. Bwana Yesu nasema ni asante hata kwa ajili ya marechesa. I commit those who are married unto your able hands oh God. Remember every marriage oh God. In a shakeup in marechesa we say no to the enemy in the name of Jesus. We declare our marriage will stand in the name of Jesus. Baba wetu na Mungu wetu umetupatia watoto, umetupatia waume our marriage will stand in the name of Jesus no power is over your power in the mighty name of Jesus father i pray that you may protect every marriage every family in the name of Jesus protect your people in the mighty name of Jesus you are the lord you are our god we trust in you in the name of Jesus baba nasema ni asante oi mitiwe otokozwe leo 
Hakuna kama wewe, wewe ni mwaminifu na wewe ni mtawala. Tunakupa ibada usiku wa leo. Pokea heshima, pokea utukufu katika jina la Yesu. Ninaomba na kushukuru. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. You are God in our lives. You are God who changes not. Our God is so faithful. Whatever you pray, believe in God. He will answer you. Read the Spirit of God. Continue to encourage you. Continue to empower your spirit every day of your life. If you want your spirit to be encouraged every morning, wake up and pray. If you want to go far in prayer, be a prayer warrior. O sinyamase, o sinyamase, o naendelea kuomba katika jina la yesu. Let us pray for the offering in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Baba, tunakupa sifa. Tunakueshimu. Tunataka kukueshimu na sadaka zetu. Na fedha zile umetubariki bwana. Baba, sipoke. Zikawe manukato mazuri. Bele zako baba yetu. Asande kwa maana wewe dia ulie tupa. Nasi bwana tunatoa kwa ajili ya kazi yako. Bless every giver, O God. Encourage them, Lord, to continue to give that they may receive the grace, my God, that you have for their lives. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I pray and I give thanks. Amen.